Designing current wall systems to withstand building movement. Welcome to Building Knowledge 101. In this video, we explore how current wall systems can be designed to accommodate building movement, such as thermal movement and live flow deflection of slabs. So current wall systems are designed to handle this daily movement. On the right, you can see uh, horizontal vertical covers. These covers are cut short to allow for thermal expansion. So you notice that it's a one thirty second gap between the horizontal covers and the vertical covers. And so as the covers heat up due to thermal strength, they'll slightly grow. But this gap will ensure that that the horizontal covers do not end up touching the vertical covers. When that happens, you can actually end up in cases where the covers will fall off the building. Um, on the right, we have a picture of a splice. Splices allow for vertical deflection. The upper section will hang from the floor above and fold over the spice leaf, allowing the current, current wall mullion to accommodate for vertical movement. On the left, you can see this vertical mullion consists of two halves that engage each other when installed. So when the building is experiencing movement such as racking or story drift, the two sections can slide by each other to accommodate that movement. On the right, we have a stacking horizontal. So this goes along with the splice zone on the previous slide, uh, where you have one half of that horizontal mounted above the splice and then the other half below, and that and it's able to accommodate that vertical movement in that splice joint. So live load effects on slab leads to vertical movement that the current wall will need to accommodate. And you can actually see the slabs behind the current wall system in this picture. This is a video that shows anchoring of a stick curtain wall system. So first you have your window anchor being installed. You notice that this anchor is slotted, so this allows the mullion to move up and down. Next, you have your dead low anchor. Notice that this anchor is not slotted, so it does not allow for vertical movement. Then you have your slice being installed. Install with another mullion coming in on top of it. So that splice joint is able to capture vertical movement. So together with the splices and the wind wall anchor, a current wall system can accommodate vertical movement from the slab. This is a horizontal stack joint in a unitized current wall system. So there's an upper section that hangs from the slab above and engages with the chicken head feature from the lower, lower section. Uh, this is also a vertical movement while still maintaining an air barrier in the system. So here's another picture of a typical current wall window anchor. This anchor does allow for vertical movement as you see it's slotted, but it still resists deflection due to wind load. That is all we have time for in this video. If you'd like to watch more of our 101 video series, subscribe to our YouTube channel, Conair Company Inc.